how bad does it have to get? I mean, to what denominator, to what lowest level do you have to reach before people really make up their mind to change? My message is, why wait? I mean, yeah. when you're feeling so altered emotionally, you feel so bad, that's the moment you could actually see yourself for the first time because you're you're not you're answering your cell phone, you're not responding to all your texts, you're not watching TV, you're not going out to dinners, you're not calling people back. You're Something's altered in you and you're starting to become self-aware, right? So then, People wait to that lowest moment where they can start to see themselves through the eyes of somebody else. Well, if you're waking up every day and you're combining a clear intention with an elevated emotion and you're changing your emotional state to be elevated, you could still see the old self from an elevated point of view and be stay conscious then from a limited point of view. And that's what I want for people. Like, let's go. I mean, what do you got to lose? What People are gonna start wondering, like, did you change your medication? <laughs> What's up with that guy? Something's different about him. You're not predictable any longer, right? Yeah. And then we say to our, our, our community, you know, when you're changing, you just stop talking about it. Yeah. You're just too busy being it. Something's happening, you know? And that's the repetition of getting a few days in a row of that really well. I always say, God, if you had a great meditation, you wake up feeling better at the end of that meditation than when you started, and you do that the next day, and then the next day, you're gonna start feeling better mm -hmm. all the time. And that your body's gonna start feeling better and everything's gonna start feeling better. And you're gonna start feeling better about life. Did you know that most people chase after money or success because they're scared? Picture this, you're all alone in a world, just you. Then, you stumble upon a place filled with gold, tons of it, way more than you could ever use, and you have a secure spot to stash it away. The catch? There's no one to steal it from you. So, would you hoard the gold or just take what you need when you need it? You'd probably opt for the latter. After all, you're the only one there, feeling secure about your treasure. Why tell this tale? It's to highlight a mindset we should cultivate. We often believe in scarcity, but the truth is quite the opposite. There's an abundance of everything, enough for you and everyone else. You've bought into the idea of scarcity and just want your slice of the pie. But in reality, there are endless pies. The world is like a bakery, turning invisible energy into tangible things. You can have whatever you desire by adopting an abundance mindset. It's the only way. You must grasp how life operates and acknowledge that your thoughts shape your reality. What you focus on mentally, the universe will confirm. Before diving deeper into this topic, consider subscribing to this channel for more life-changing content. I hope you're as excited as I am about the incredible potential of your mind and the art of manifestation. If you're ready to uncover the secrets within yourself and make positive changes almost instantly, then this journey is for you. Remember, it all starts with understanding the immense power of your mind. Think of your mind as a fertile garden. Whatever seeds you plant, it will grow. When you really concentrate on a particular goal or what you want to happen, something called the law of attraction kicks in. It's like a magnet pulling that exact thing toward you. But to make this work, there are some important steps to follow. First off, you have to be super clear about what you want. Having a clear picture in your mind is like having a map. It helps you know where you're going. And when you're clear about what you want, it's easier to make it happen. Think of your desires as seeds you're planting in your mind's garden. Be detailed about what you want, write it down, and give it life. By putting your thoughts on paper, you're sending them out into the universe, making your dreams more real. Your feelings are like the fuel that drives this whole process. When you imagine what you want, try to feel as if you already have it. The stronger and more positive your emotions, the quicker your dreams can come true. Emotions are like the connection between you and the universe. In this huge world of endless possibilities, your energy links up with what you want. When your energy matches your desires, the universe starts working with you to make things happen. Your brain also gets involved, filtering out stuff that's important and bringing it to your attention. 
Your clear goals help your brain focus on finding opportunities that line up with what you want. Another useful tool are affirmations. These are like powerful statements that train your mind to believe in your success. Let's create affirmations that speak to the power of now and the positivity we want to bring into our lives. When we frame our affirmations in the present tense with uplifting language, our subconscious minds become more open to embracing empowering beliefs. Regularly using affirmations can help us break through any barriers created by negative thoughts or self-doubt, allowing us to manifest our dreams freely. In moments of doubt, let's affirm confidently, I am capable of achieving anything I set my mind to. Affirmations have a remarkable ability to unearth and reshape the limiting beliefs buried deep within our subconscious minds, freeing us to pursue our desires with conviction. By replacing these limiting beliefs with positive affirmations, we're rewiring our subconscious minds, paving the way for new neural pathways aligned with our goals. Consistency is key to making affirmations effective. Through regular repetition, we reinforce these positive beliefs, gradually weakening the hold of limiting ones. Integrate affirmations into your daily routine and witness profound shifts in your thoughts and actions over time. Gratitude acts as a hidden key, unlocking abundance in our lives. It's the simple practice of genuinely appreciating what we have, inviting the universe to bless us with even more. Begin each morning by acknowledging your blessings, whether through a gratitude journal or a moment of reflection. This practice generates a positive energy that attracts abundance into our lives effortlessly. Gratitude doesn't just enhance our well-being, it transforms it. By shifting our focus from scarcity to abundance, gratitude aligns us with the positive frequency of the universe. It uplifts our emotional and mental state, replacing fear and discontentment with joy and contentment. These positive emotions elevate our vibrational frequency, attracting more positivity into our lives. Even in the face of challenges, maintaining an attitude of gratitude is crucial. Embrace difficulties as opportunities for growth, shifting your perspective to see them as stepping stones on your journey to success. By focusing on gratitude, we empower ourselves to discover solutions and opportunities previously unseen, allowing us to navigate life's obstacles with resilience and optimism. When you embrace gratitude, especially during tough times, you kickstart a positive cycle in your life. The universe responds by giving you even more reasons to be thankful, even when things are hard. By staying grateful, you boost your energy, attracting good things and lucky breaks that help you tackle challenges. While thoughts, affirmations, and gratitude are all powerful, taking inspired action is what makes your dreams come true. Inspired action isn't about pushing too hard. It's about going with the flow of life. Trust your instincts, and when opportunities pop up, jump in with confidence and excitement. This kind of action tells the universe you're ready for what you want. It's important to realize that inspired action isn't about forcing things. It's about staying open to signs and chances that come your way. It's the last step that turns your dreams into real-life results. So, let's keep moving forward on this amazing journey of bringing our dreams to life, armed with these powerful tools. Surrendering is another key part of making your dreams come true. It's not about giving up on what you want but about letting go of control and trusting in the wisdom of the universe. Sometimes, we create problems by sticking too tightly to our plans and deadlines. Surrendering means loosening your grip on these details and believing that the universe knows the perfect time for your dreams to come true. It's about focusing on what and why you want something and letting go of how and when it'll happen. You've got to have faith that things are falling into place in the best way for you. By surrendering, you get in sync with the natural rhythm of the universe. Instead of trying to force your dreams into a specific shape, 
you open yourself up to receiving them in ways that might be even more beautiful and surprising. Surrendering is about trusting in the universe and having faith that it's always on your side. It means letting go of the need to control how things happen and being open to endless possibilities that might be beyond what you can imagine right now. It's also about finding peace in the present moment, being happy with where you are while keeping your dreams in sight. Avoid feeling like you're lacking or desperate because those feelings can stop good things from coming your way. Instead, focus on feeling peaceful, trusting, and knowing that everything is working out for your best interests. Being at peace in the moment is important because it puts you in sync with the flow of good things. When you're stuck on feeling like you don't have enough or you're impatient, it sends out a signal that repels the things you want. Being mindful, paying attention to the present moment, is a great way to stay peaceful. It helps you let go of past regrets and future worries and appreciate what's happening right now. Mindfulness lets you see and enjoy all the good things in your life as they are. When you're content and accepting, you send out vibes of gratitude and abundance that match up with what the universe sends back to you. So, know what you want. Use positive affirmations to change your deep-down beliefs. Be thankful every day. Take action when you feel inspired. And most of all, go with the flow of life. If you stick with these things and truly believe in yourself, you can make your dreams real in no time. Always remember your thoughts are like seeds you plant in the garden of your mind. Your mind can make real whatever you focus on the most. Your thoughts kickstart the law of attraction, linking up what's inside you with what's outside. Make sure you're clear about what you want, write it down, and let those thoughts take shape in the world. Affirmations are your buddies on this journey. Use positive words and act like what you want is already happening. Say these affirmations with confidence and strong feelings, and you'll create a strong force that pulls your dreams toward you. Gratitude is a big deal too. Every day, take time to notice and be thankful for the good stuff in your life. Just being thankful lifts your mood and brings more good things your way. Don't forget, it's not just about thinking and saying affirmations. Taking inspired action is what gets you closer to your dreams. Make sure your actions match up with what you want and what your gut is telling you. Stay open to new opportunities and be ready to step out of your comfort zone. That's where real growth and change happen, outside of what you're used to. And lastly, go with the flow of the universe. Trust that things will happen when they're meant to and let go of trying to control how and when. Instead, focus on what you want and why you want it. When you surrender to what's happening, you might be surprised by how things turn out. Sticking with these ideas and believing in yourself is what will get you to your dreams in no time. When you mix together clarity, affirmations, gratitude, action, and surrender, you become a true expert at making things happen. Your life can be like a painting of all the things you want, and the universe is ready to help make it happen. Believe in yourself and all the amazing things you can do. Embrace these powerful ideas, and you'll see your life change right in front of you. This journey is yours, my friends, and it's time to make your dreams real. It's time to tap into the incredible power inside you and start creating the life you want. If you found this helpful, consider subscribing to our channel so you never miss out on more great advice. Thanks for joining me on this journey of discovery. Remember, the magic is inside you, and the universe is here to help you make it happen.